this ship must be cursed. It's the only way we can explain all this evil shit that's happening down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? Wait, where's Conrad? Has anyone seen him? We got split up. I, I saw him. I, I, I mean, Fliss and I both did, uh, right? <clears throat> yeah, but just for a second, I tried to catch up, but he was gone. Gone where? Why? Like, this, this just doesn't add up. I feel like you're not telling us everything, Fliss. Look, I don't know what you want me to tell you. I didn't see anything. Is that the truth? Because you better hope it is. Okay, we're going back right now and we're gonna find my brother. Julia. He could be dying right now, we have to. We will, just not yet. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some like, like evil, like literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- that doesn't sound that crazy right about now. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... This can't all be happening. Maybe like one thing could, but not all of these crazy things. It's too much of a coincidence. There's gotta be something going on here. What can we absolutely be sure about? What do we know that's real? Did you see the gold, anything? Manchurian gold isn't actually gold. It's a fucking chemical and it's leaking all over cargo hold too. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this isn't exactly what our friendly fishermen are expecting either. <sighs> this should go over well. What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one big floating coffin. So where did all the corpses come from? They actually look like they've been scared to death. This whole place reeks of weird. Dirty, stinky, weird. And I don't like it. It's like this place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? I guess that's one way to look at it. I read a letter. I, I found it before. It said the guards here were scared of ghosts. We found a note that said a bunch of guys tried to get out of guard duty because they were really freaked out by something. They even set up a watch to see if they could catch a glimpse of the ghost, but apparently they didn't find anything. Maybe they really were just rumors. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... That's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. these if they weren't Swiss cheese.
find a way up? Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. have been moving some pretty dangerous cargo. over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. I'll pull you up. This is where I chased Gunrad before. Over here. Got a way through here. Last log shows him caught in a storm.
find a radio yet? No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. I'm not exactly confident about our chances of survival at this point. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? was blown off course, cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Look, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask them for help. Hey, hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Holy shit, we got him. Uh. If you can hear us. We're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees, 30 minutes south, 151 degrees, 20 minutes west. Please, get here now. We need help. Please repeat. Please repeat. Over. We're on a freighter, abandoned, huge and old. Hello, hello, is anyone out there? Please, come in! Hey! Come here, look! This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the picture's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? Hey, if you're sure you're up for it, I believe you got it, bro. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this, trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. Okay, Julia, it's you and I. still work? Everyone okay?
We're okay. What are we gonna do? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Okay, we'll wait here by the radio. Here. Hey. After you. I'm guessing these are the lower levels of the ship. I wish I could actually, you know, enjoy this. What the hell are you talking about? Well, in any other circumstance, you know, this place would be the coolest place to explore, like, like ever. I'm gonna say no, not at all. Says the girl who couldn't wait to dive a wreck. Shut up. Here, come check this out. Look, down there. Looks like the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Uh, the ladder's broken off here. I think I can just... Wait! Uh, Are you okay? Yeah, uh, all good. Just come down. What's up? That, did you see it? Um, hello? Okay, so, I, so I'm seeing things, but you're not. Okay, so follow my thinking here. We know this ship was carrying Manchurian gold, which was actually some kind of dangerous chemical, right? And there's just like weird fog everywhere, all over the place. Maybe that's the Manchurian gold. And maybe it's fucking us all up, like in the head, you know? I mean, I definitely saw some crazy shit that I could have sworn was real, but Maybe it wasn't. We know the crew were scared shitless of something. None of it happened. None of it was real. It was just a hallucination. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. We know the plane was here and that they shot at it. Could have been a result of the psychosis. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. Dry clothes? Yeah. Hey, hey, I found it! Oh, thank God. And it's working! Yeah, this is it, all right. Just throw the switch and let's get back upstairs. Okay, let's get back upstairs. There's gotta be another way up. <laughs> we lost power, but we have it back. Can you hear me? Over! We need help, now! There are things on the ship that are trying to hurt us. Over! Recovery mission is en route to your location. Over. Oh, come on. 
I'm work damn it. Look at this. The rebreather. The fisherman must have brought it over from the Duke of Milan. You think it still works? Looks like it's got a little juice left. Maybe a couple of minutes? Should we bring it with us? I mean, it's heavy. It's just gonna slow us down. Are you crazy? Half the ship is submerged. It could be a lifesaver. No use hiding, you little foot. What's the problem with sharing all that gold, eh? There must be plenty of that to go around, more than enough. And we're all in this together, right? Trying to cut me out of the deal? <laughs> Oh, 
Are we safe? Please tell me we're safe. Oh. Yeah, totally. I mean, these doors were meant to withstand all sorts of... Stuff. Okay. Okay. None of you move. None of you go on changing on me now. Turn around. Slow. Real slow. Okay. All right. Not changing. None of that. Raise your hands up. Slow. No, no. Not like that. I said, no changing. Just put the gun down. Nobody has to get hurt. You think I wanted to hurt anybody? I didn't get a choice in this, did I? It's in you too, isn't it? Isn't it now? Ah, not again! It's all gone changing on me! What? What's changing? Stay away! Stay back from the mist! What? There's no mist, man! Don't breathe it! Don't breathe the mist! Why can't we breathe the mist? What does it do? It's... life! Bringing things to life that shouldn't be alive. It's inside now. Inside with us now. Please just calm down. Stop. Stop. It's in one of us, isn't it? Put the gun down now. Why would you say that? Why are you telling me what to do? Yeah, you breathed in the mist. It's happening. I can feel it. Okay, all, all right, look, I, there was, you know, something back there. Uh, maybe a mist or a fog, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No, look, we held our breath. We did not breathe any of that stuff. <laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. You're holding your breath right now. Oh, good. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? It's in me, isn't it? I can feel it swirling around in there. It's changing me. On the inside. No, no, I, 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 I can't see it. You're all right, man. There's no mist. Stop! Stop lying! You can all see it in me, can't you? You're just lying. The mist is inside. Hey, man, come on. Just put the... Wait by the radio. Why? I'm gonna check the next level. There might be some more gear down there we can use. Uh... I'm not going far. Just wait by the radio.
saw the, the, the big guy. He had the distributor cap. Give me the weapon. This must have been what we just heard. Oh no, what's that? Doesn't matter. We need that distributor cap. Here! He had to have come this way. I'm gonna make this jump, Alex. I'll have to find another way around. that. Sometimes you just get lucky.
Duke of Milan ain't going anywhere. Guess that means we aren't either. Best I can figure it. We got a couple days. Maybe more if we can collect some rainwater. Never in a million years would I have guessed that starving to death is how I'd go. You don't understand, really. I mean, just how crazy it got down there. I mean, just how fucking out of control. 
He was an asshole. <sighs> was. Connie meant well. No matter what moronic thing he was up to, he always meant well. It's just a big old puppy dog. <laughs> just trying to make everyone laugh. <laughs> that fucker that took our boat, he thought there was gold. He wanted the gold. That's all this was about. I mean, there were things down there that, you know, he shouldn't have been alive, you know? The kind of things that can make you go insane. Connie meant well. No matter what moronic thing he was up to, he always meant well. It's just a big old puppy dog. <laughs> just trying to make everyone laugh. <laughs> Manchurian gold. Well, that turned out to be quite a bit different than we expected. That's it, game over. You're done, for now at least. You could always try again, see if you can't do better next time around. Not a bad effort, some lived, some died. All your fault. And the distributor cap? Boom. Unfortunate. It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. Till we meet again, maybe in Little Hope, maybe somewhere else. But be certain, we will meet again. It's inevitable. Won't you spare me over till another year? 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 Oh, death. Oh, death. Won't you spare me over till another year? Well, what is this that I can't see with ice cold hands digging hold of me? Well, I am death, none can excel. I open the door to heaven or hell. Everybody's looking, trying to find a way out. See them seeing every day what this world's all about. You're realizing that it's hard, you're trying to pick the right path. There's poor people, poor streets inside the neighborhood mass. Bearing scars of the past, they keep trying to escape. Destiny within their eyes, these are the tears of our fate. All these numbers of our lives that we keep trying to equate. They got us living every day. We're in search of that gate. Pray. Oh, death. Oh, death. Won't you spare me over to the night? Someone would pray once you come and call me another day. The children prayed, the preacher preached. Time and mercy is out of your reach. Low and 
behold the pale horse and the rider who decides the fate of one who made a failed choice with a tail off behind it the trails off in the fire that spark those who don't know they're stuck on a stale course yeah we all face death when it comes to take your breath usually without knowing how many days are left some raise their chest others cower when it comes whether you're living in the towers or down in the slums your feet till you can't walk I'll lock your door till you can't talk I'll close your eyes till you can't see this very hour come and go with me praying heaven's coming praying it doesn't come late this is for real man it's how I push through my pain when ass is always falling and death's rain it's cold outside death look me in my eyes hold through these plans man we gotta be wise hold through together then they will rise I'm saying peace for all my people that can see through the lies And can that la la Brisa running up her thighs While she's singing Oh, oh, yeah Oh, oh, yeah Won't you spare me over to the night I'm death, I come to take the soul To leave the body and leave it cold Throw up the fish off of the frame Dirt and worm both have a claim Take a moment to reflect on Think of all the things in your life that you slept on Or slip through your fingers like Teflon Cause you lost your focus steady Think about the next dawn Saying that the next dawn you make things better But you didn't get a chance to make your reparations Better make some preparations But if you're not ready yet Death comes for all of us my friends So you better get Whoever it was, they're gone. Okay, very good. Who's there? I fashioned her with my own hand. Okay. 